Alright, so what's up guys? It's your boy Sepik Koga here, and today we are going to be playing some more The Last of Us. And this is part 7, I believe. Yeah. Pretty sure this is part 7. <clears throat> Hold on real quick. I'm going to see if I'm right or not. My bad. Just hold on. And this is part seven. I was correct. Yay. I so smart. I so smart. Dang, I wanna. I so smart. Yay. Oh, shivs last longer, bet. <clears throat> I'll take that. Thank you very much. <clears throat> I'll make a shiv. Alright, um, do I have more ammo on that? Oh, yes, I do. I got 13. Alright, bet. Ooh, uh, let's tour. We already read this, so clear the fences. So, if you haven't seen that video. Pause it right there and look at it. Ooh, I got 50. Yeah, maximum health, right? Yeah. Yeah. Get that maximum health. Oh, wait. We already kind of saw this, but... You know how to play this? Yeah. No, I do I not. I, always wanted to I mean, I know how to play it hey, on the computer, but not in real life. Board. Shut up, Bill. Bobby, what? Let it go. Bobby Fisher. <laughs> Found everything you need. We're good. We're good, Bill. Don't leave the door open. Do, 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 do. Shut up, Bill. Bill. I will shoot you right now, Bill. What you should have done, but just left him back there. You weren't kidding about him. Yeah, he's one of a kind. Take a look around up here. Nothing in there that I need. Go ahead, take whatever you want. I saw a group of hunters coming dangerously close to town. Luckily, a pack of infected chased them off. Reminder, put out more warning signs. Let them know you're serious. Yeah, sure, Bill. Sure. So, do you save yourself when... Oh, I got you. What kind of trouble are you in? Just a job. S simple drop off. What are you delivering? <laughs> that little brat? Haha. <laughs> Fuck you too. <laughs> oh. You know, I, I hope you know what you're doing. Are you kidding me with this guy? So where are we going, Bill? We have the safe house. More of an armor. No gremlin. We're gonna fix up a car. We? You know how to fix a Bill. Move, Ellie. I need Move. We're gonna need more guns. Fuck. I don't need no goddamn baseball bat. my question about Tess. Yeah, I thought the two of you were inseparable. She's busy. Yeah, sure. Busy. <laughs> like, might be trouble in paradise. Yeah, something like that. All right. Mm. Here we go. 
away. So, why don't you fix one of these cars? Oh my god, you're a genius. I mean, the whole time, why on earth hadn't I thought about fixing one of these cars? Okay, don't be a dick. Their tires are rotted and their batteries are dead. Are you done? Can't even begin to think what the inside of the engine blocks look like. Only ones making new car batteries are the military. God damn I knew it. Just waiting for them to come. Oh god, what the heck was that? Oh, headshot, baby. Oh, snap. Clickers, get back. Looking around, you know how the last of us be. You always look around, see, because you end up finding stuff. Fucking bottles. I don't need no goddamn bottle. Bricks are better because you can bash somebody's skull in with a freaking brick. You picked a hell of a place to hold up, didn't you? You know, as bad as those things are, at least they're predictable. Normal people that scare me. You of all people should understand that. What does that mean? Yeah. Nothing. You sure that gate's gonna hold them? Well, I don't have a key. So which way? We're right here. In the cellar. Boop. You don't touch anything. And you close the door. Let's gear up. Uh uh. What? I need a gun. No, you don't. Joel, I can handle myself. No. Just stay here. It's fine. Just wait around for you two to get me killed. Well, this goes on record as the worst fucking job you've ever taken. Hey, it's up there. How in the hell is Tess okay with this suicide mission? It's actually her idea. Really? Well, the broad's not as smart as I thought she was. But, fuck her. Seriously, you gotta take that kid back to where you found her. I can't just take her back. Then send her packing, let her find her own way. Look, let me tell you a story. Once upon a time, I had somebody that I cared about. A partner. Somebody I had to look after. And in this world, that sort of shit's good for one thing. Getting you killed. So you know what I did? I wasn't the fuck up. And I realized it's gotta be just me. Bill, it ain't, it ain't like that. It's bullshit. It is just like that. What I say to you when we walk down the steps? What I say? I'm just fixing your stupid pile. Don't touch. God damn it. You keep babysitting long enough and eventually it's gonna blow up in Bill. your face. Can we please just get on with it? Here. Let's get on with it. Yeah, let's get on with it. Let's go. <laughs> <clears throat> Shuck on. I got something I gotta show you. What you got? New toy from the toy box. <laughs> Ooh, pliers. Good tools. This is a nail bomb. You 
gotta be really careful. This thing blows, it shreds anybody standing nearby. Yeah, I've seen your handiwork. <laughs> Pretty good, huh? <clears throat> Look around, see if there's any more tools or whatever. Alright. No, only if they had suppressors in this game, that would be really good. But you do have the bow, but still. Alright, let's do this. <clears throat> I'm going to actually be needing a long gun holster. Click capacity. Come <clears throat> on, now let's put a scope on it. Get one of those. All right. Well, there we go. Cool. No. Oh, snap. <laughs> No, I want the rifle out. Yeah, so if I aim this. Ooh, that's a nice scope. I like that. Alright, cool. Says nine. I'll take this. So this holds ten bullets then, because I have nine and it's missing one, so it holds ten. Three and this holds four. Uh, I like this though. What is it? Packs a punch. There's actually, I'm pretty sure, some more shotgun ammo around here. Maybe. Maybe not. So we got shotguns and bombs. The hell are we doing with them? Well, every few okay, weeks, cool. this military caravan rides through town. I assume they're out looking for supplies, but you, you'd be amazed at the shit that they overlook. Anyway, a few months back, they were rolling through and they get overrun with this horde of infected. They were all over the truck. The plow's right in the side of the high school. Still sitting there with the battery in. So we take that battery and we put it in another car. Bingo. I wanted to get it, but it seemed too dangerous with all the infected on that part of town. Fuck it. Joel needs a car. Hey, what if it's damaged? Nah. Those trucks are like tanks. Just sitting there. Makes it might work. Anything up here? No. Okay. Wow. Nice place you got here. <clears throat> anything to confess, this would be the place to do it. Mm, nice, nice. That's not the confessional booth, that's my room. All right, I'm not touching anything. Group of runners tricking most of the bombs on the south side of town. It's time to do another pass. Don't forget to mark the map with all bomb locations. Alright, time to sack up. Out. 
I'm on a highway. You don't need to be looking at that. I've seen worse. All right, then. Let's get a move on. <clears throat> This gate, it's all new territory to me. I'm on it. Did I hear that? Keep quiet. Gosh dang it, Bill. I thought you had that one. Taking our puppet doll to the vet. Oh, oh God. Yeah, take that. More pilly pills. Hold up. I got a key for that gate. Just to move quietly. Easy, easy. Bill, get the other one, please. Or not. Cool. Well, you weren't kidding about this place, were you?
Oh wait, of course. I got my bow. I didn't mean to do that. Broken. I didn't check over there yet. If you guys would give me a gun, I can help you kill some of these fuckers. Shut up, just shut up. Oh god. Okay, well if I can wait. I'm going to go over here real quick and search all this stuff. I'm gonna search this house. See what's in it. Could you guys move? Jeez, move out of the freaking way, Bill. Ooh, Firefly Pendant. Peter Mrazic? Cool. <sighs> Took me a second to get it. <laughs> Healthy health. Always okay. Over here then. I forgot I had the bow. I should have upgraded the bow. Completely forgot about the bow. Should have upgraded that because that would have helped a lot more. I should get the arrow back since it was a headshot. Yep. Ooh. Okay, let's make another one of these because this has already been done. the next way forward I 
Ah, this way. Okay. This way. It's tied on the other side. What about going through here? What, the doggy door? <clears throat> Very careful. Of course. She's so tiny. Okay, Bill. There's more of those clicker things inside the house. Oh, shit. Things yet. Pop Stay off an arrow right here. And since you're not a clicker, oh wait, you are. Yeah. Never mind. Aw, you took my freaking arrow, man. Come on. Oh, never mind. You didn't. There we go. Actually, since you're a standing still, I can pop off an arrow on all of you. That missed? You gotta be kidding me. About two more minutes. Okay. Who the hell left us here? You got friends in town? No. Although I got some idea he might have come through here. School's on the other side of this house. Let's get inside. Oh, eh. Freaking disgusting, bro. Disgusting. Oh, what's in here? There's gotta be something in here. Yeah, I knew it. A whole bunch of stuff. Yes, please. Okay. See, so always gotta have two shivs on you, cause one to like use on clicker or something, and then one to open a shiv door once you come across one. So that I always have and have on me. Open up a shivy door. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I'm full on shivs. Dang it, it's a perfectly good shiv. Ah. Oh. Dang it. Come on. It's a perfectly good shiv, too. Frick, man. Ooh, letter. Boy's diary. 
It's official. October 4th. It's official. School is closed indefinitely. I guess this outbreak is good for something. No school, no homework, which is fine by me. Now what do I do with all this free time? October 5th. Mom and Dad were fighting. They were somehow yelling at each other while whispering at the same time. Sound like Mom wants to leave. Go to her sister's house. Dad says it's safe here that the outbreak won't reach our town. October 6th. Dad yelled at me for listening to the radio. He says that the news is bullshit. Mom agreed with with him while putting on a brave face, but I can tell she's scared. They both look scared. October 7th, I think Dad felt bad about yesterday. Gadget was asleep in my bed, and Dad didn't say anything about it. He came in, p- petted him, sighed, and walked out. I've never seen him like this. October 10th. Dad was consoling mom last night. Aunt Karen is dead, at least. That's what I think I heard. When we sat for breakfast, and was all quiet as if nothing happened. I played along. October 15th. Officer Jones stopped by and chatted with dad. More like whispered with dad. Lots of that going on around these days. Afterwards, dad told us that we have to leave town. We have to go to a new home that the military will protect us. I'm only allowed to bring one bag with me. Mom just sat there. October 16th. Where we're going, there are no pets at all. We drove to the edge of town with Gadget. I took off his call and let him go. On the drive back, dad kept talking about how he'll be fine. He meant he's meant to be free in the wild. Whatever. October 7th. It's time dad says we'll be back before we know it. I think it's full of it. Hmm. Cool. Poor kid. I let his old puppy dog go. Hey, you got a second? Yeah. Not right now, Ellie. Okay. What? Joel, talk to her, man. Talk to her now. You can't just do that. You gotta talk to her. Come on, man. Don't just push her away like that. You gotta talk to her. Alright, well, is that's all we have for today. I hope you guys like this video. But please like and subscribe to see more videos by me. And tune in to the next video. Goodbye.